wind is a powerful force in the world, able to cause such devastation, and yet could help to power our society. It's all to do with the strength of the wind. In 1805, Francis Beaufort created a scale to measure the strength of the wind, the Beaufort Scale. And the use of his scale continues to this day. The Beaufort Scale was initially designed for British sailors within the Navy to measure the strength of the wind by using their ship's sails as a reference. Today, however, the scale was used by the Met Office to alert the public of severe winds. For this video, even though the scale was based around the sea, this video will focus on the effects of various wind strengths on land. Besides, most people live on land and this is where the effect of the wind is most prevalent. Furthermore, the wind speeds are rounded to the nearest kilometre per hour. A force zero is a calm wind. If you see smoke rising from a chimney, the smoke will be almost vertical. The wind speed at this point is under 1 km per hour. Force 1 winds are known as light air. The smoke from the chimney will now begin to move in the wind's direction, although any leaves on the ground refuse to move. The wind speed can be up to 5 km per hour. Force 2 winds are known as a light breeze. The leaves on the ground now begin to rustle. The wind is also strong enough to be felt on exposed skin. The wind speed can be up to 12 km per hour. Force 3 winds are known as a gentle breeze. The leaves are now in constant motion and flags on a flagpole are in motion in the wind. The wind speed can be up to 20 km per hour. Force 4 winds are known as a moderate breeze. Small branches on trees now begin to move and if you have long hair, you might find it blowing around around your face. The wind speed can be up to 29 km per hour. Force 5 winds are known as a fresh breeze. Moderate branches now move and small trees are in motion. The wind speed can be up to 39 km per hour. Force 6 winds are known as a strong breeze. Using an umbrella is now difficult and any empty bins now topple over. The wind speed can be up to 50 km per hour. Force 7 winds are known as a moderate gale. Considerable effort is needed to walk against the wind and whole trees are in motion. The wind speed can be up to 62 km per hour. Force 8 winds are gale force winds. Small twigs and branches break off trees and cars begin to veer on the road. The wind speed can be up to 75 km per hour. Force 9 winds are known as a strong gale. Small trees now break and all temporary road signs blow over. The wind speed can be up to 88 km per hour. Force 10 winds are storm force winds. Trees are now uprooted and minimal structural damage is likely. The wind speed can be up to 102 km per hour. Force 11 winds are known as a violent storm. In these winds there is extensive damage to vegetation and structures. The wind speed can be up to 118 km per hour. Force 12 winds are destructive. Any unsecured objects are held about and there is now widespread damage to all structures. The wind speed is above 118 km per hour and is often classified as a Category 1 hurricane. Hurricanes have destruction unparalleled to any level on the Beaufort scale.